Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue, which is an RPG Maker style horror game where you get trapped in school, and hopefully you survive. So to give a little bit of a setup for this game, and specifically this version of the prologue, so I've played a previous kind of demo. Um, I think it also might have been called prologue, I'm not sure. This is in a sort of um, remake, like an extensive remake of that prologue. This is going to lead into the main game. It's kind of a separate old entity, but it, I'm assuming it's establishing the events of what's going to occur in the main game, which is still in development, and um, going by screenshots coming along just fine. Proceed to interact with the environment. To give an idea of the increased scale, I know the original demo only had like one ending. Uh, this one's supposed to have a lot of them. There's a white flower on the ground. Pick up the flower. Or not. I don't need to pick up any flowers. I need to pick up a flower. The building head seems locked somehow. To use an item stand close, it's like the item from the menu. No. Door of four colored lights, it's locked. Take out the flower, yes. Now, a feature of the prologue was you could, um, kind of mess around. Like, you get, you had a lot of choices in uh, dynamics based on how you did things. So, we're gonna be a bit antagonistic. No, it's my flower now. The door of four colored lights. Yeah, that's right. Door open. Fascinating. You've done the opposite of what I expected. A delightful surprise. How did you know, I wonder? Perhaps you're different. Or perhaps... You cheated. How on? Regardless... I advise you not to mess with things that don't belong to you. It is not safe for you, as you already know in this place. Things are not always what they seem. The answers you're looking for are not yours to take. You're not ready to learn the truth, and the truth is not willing to be learned by you. I can't stop you from coming. Just know that if you do, you will be killed. Such is the way of our world. That rocks. Take me to animate Demon Boy World. Whoa, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's 11. I should get to it. Wake up. Oh no. You moved it. I didn't, I swear, I know. You know I hate this type of thing. This can't possibly be happening. It's spelled die. Oh my. Oh no. Stop joking around. This is serious. Ah, we should not have played this. I told you we're going to be cursed. Knock, knock. It's Knuckles. What was that? Is that a ghost? We summon a ghost. Oh my god, oh my god. You're making too much noise. Oh, it's just Cat. What's the crazy knocking? What was that for? Did that spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. I could say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually... Say hello to the new member of the cult club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three are not part of the club, are you? That's funny. I did pin you of all people as the cult type cat. That's because I'm not. I'm part of the sleep club. Hey! We we're doing something here! I'll save you the trouble. All three of you moved it. Huh? 
The planchette. Every game. You all moved it. There's no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the idiomotor effect. To be put, just like your body reacts to pain reflexively, it may also react to ideas and move on its own. It pretty much bypasses the part of the brain which we use for conscious behavior. Is all that different from blinking or breathing? The effect is even stronger when a bunch of gullible people who are desperate to believe in ghost stories get together and play. There was an experiment where the players were blindfolded, and suddenly the ghosts could no longer spell messages. You can try it if you don't believe me. In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are really just your imagination playing tricks on you. Great job killing the mood. Yeah, the art's definitely improved. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, Cat. Oh, you'll be thanking me a lot after this. Since you wait, I'm gonna start getting up to some mischief pretty soon. Always a pleasure. And by thinking, you're gonna hate me. Alright, time to search. I should go over my notes to make sure I don't forget anything. Are you my save crow? A stuffed crow. Ah, an interesting choice of decoration. Crow can save your game. Save often since the future is uncertain. Just like real life. Oh man, I think I forgot how this theme was. Oh boy, here we go. Anyway, I'm gonna reload to the intro really quick to um, do the, the flower puzzle a little differently. Okay, so let's put the flower in. The flower sank into the water. Yep, that's blood. Pity. You thought that would work. You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The solution may seem obvious, but... There is always another way. You may not notice it right away, but your actions will have an impact sooner or later. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always in the shadow of choice. Also, you know very well this is in your home. So why do you mess with things that don't belong to you? You're not welcome here. Look, this is the result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. What do you think? Bird! Does this still look like a flower to you? You're not prepared to deal with the truth, are you? I can't stop you from coming here. But if you're foolish enough to cross my path, I'll kill you myself. Such is the way of our world. So the, the intro is pretty good, because it does establish a very strong your choices are going to matter and kind of think outside the box because you're in a dream haunted horror demon world. Okay, so let's go and do stuff. Now, from playing the previous demo, remember my notes, make sure I'm not forgetting anything in this room before leaving. You got a lot of things you could do, and there was like a lot of detail, and you could be just absolutely awful to everyone, which I'm going to do on this route. It's a school bag. There's something shiny inside. Do you need something? Maybe later. Money. A spherical model of the Earth. Red crosses mark certain locations. A cardboard box. Marked with a symbol. There's still the tape. The ruins my friend mentioned may be in here, but I need a way to open it. Some books and jars filled with something. Still looking radio. Turn it on. What are you even doing? Just looking around. A crystal ball resting on a cushion. Well, that cheap plastic exterior really makes it look authentic. This door won't open. A cold breeze blows in from the outside. Close the window, yes. Some small plants. The drawer underneath is empty, like my soul. Suspicious new articles and posters representing magic circles. Book and The Truth Behind Mermaids Exposed. Sounds like a YouTube video. There's a book entitled Magic Circles for Simpletons. Some chalk here. 
pick a chalk. Yes. Don't draw yet. It's a box for the game the girls were playing. It says Ouija game board for two to four players. Get answers from beyond. Warning, we take no responsibility for any adverse effects playing this game could cause you to your loved ones. Such as disappointment, I presume. A trash can, it seems to be full of my souls. All of them. A thick purple book. A spell book. It looks weird and also looks fake. I need to bother you all. She's really concentrated on fixing ribbon. That's not to disturb her. I bet you think you're so funny. We have our plans for the night anyway. Whatever you say. So what are you doing here? Visiting the school tonight is hardly normal no matter what you're looking for. I could ask you the same question. You already know what we're doing. Keyword were. Truth is, I'm doing the same thing as you girls. But spookier than your game. A game? Can we join in? I thought you had plans for the night. We can probably spare an hour or two. In any case, it's a one-person ritual, so you can't join me on it. Figures. Or can you? If you like this kind of occult stuff, why aren't you in the club? Only nerds join this club. Alright. That's not entirely false. We did bring any other games, not even a deck of cards. No, not really. We didn't anticipate someone ruining our game. Fair enough. What are you looking at? Garbage. So how'd you get in here? You got a key from someone. I got a key from someone. She got a key from someone. Couldn't you just have joined the club? Why? Is that what you did? Join the club just for the key. This conversation isn't going as planned. What were we looking for earlier? Materials for the ritual. Shouldn't you have gathered them ahead of time? Now that's boring. Do you also do your homework ahead of time? I don't know what to say to that. We'll probably go home soon. I think it's all your dialogue. Okay. Crow. Bark. Better read my notes to make sure I'm not forgetting anything in this room. Yeah, check our notes. Candles, chalk, lighter. I need three rooms, 12 candles, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, and chalk. Sort the desk in each classroom, turn off all lights and draw the curtains in each classroom. Draw a path going through the three rooms with chalk. In the middle room, place one candle on each desk. Light the candle, wait at least five minutes. After waiting, burn the tuft of hair in one of the candles. Put all the candles, close your eyes and cut to 100. Open your eyes and then profit. Alright, so I need to search the school for the items first. Yeah. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? There's no ring in the hallways. While moving, hold shift to run! I feel like there's a ending tied to not running in the hallways. They said there's like a much more endings. I'm like, hmm. Karma, you know what I mean? I paid more of some important school papers. An exciting trash can. Alright, let's see. According to my notes, I get to move the desks to the sides in all three classrooms. Then I can draw a path in the middle of each one of a chalk. I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to get everything I need first. Between virtual notes, drawing. Should I start the desk in this classroom now? Why not? This should be easy. Push the desk in the green zone to complete the puzzle. That was easy. Simple trash can, its contents look trashy. Happy green plant. I look for secrets! Geometry, pair of scissors. Teen scissors. Some classroom attendance schedules, boring textbooks. Wooden desk, wooden desk. This is my desk. Keep all kinds of cool stuff here. This might be useful. Take dusty hairpin, yes. 
one desk. Some very fixed school related books. Some books and chalk. I don't have enough chalk, but more the merrier. Clean chalkboard. Close the curtain. We're done here. Chalkboard boxes with a symbol, there's silver tape. Anyway, open this. I'm not gonna carry the entire box around. Dun 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 dun. Finally, let's cut this open. Dun 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 dun. There's a bunch of useless trash in here. Huh? This little box may be it. There's three runes, but the ritual didn't mention a specific one. Which one should I take? Let's see. Protective rune. Yeah, that's probably a good thing. Do nothing. So we can switch it later if we like change our mind. Okay. Should I start the desk in this classroom now? Yes. Let's get started. There we go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you said the same thing. Book and shock. Oh no. Curtains here are missing. According to the ritual instructions, I need to black out all the rooms. Where will I find new currents? It's locked. This room is- what is this room anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. This room is... Hmm, I guess I can't do anything about it. This leads downstairs and outside of the school. I should be able to find everything I need on this floor. I need to go downstairs. Or is there? Yes, this is scary. Nice. That night, I got cold feet, I guess. I went home without completing the ritual. Despite that, I made plans to try again. However, both my notes and the letter had disappeared without a trace. It's for the better. Good end. I tried telling myself that maybe the ritual was a scam anyways. But now, how will I ever know? Dead End K2. Cold Cat Feet. So I said I was going to go down the mean route, but I guess I'll go down the nice route first. For now. Might be easier to branch the endings that way. Being a little bit Machiavellian on this. Exam schedule. Boring trash can. Just start this in classroom now. Not yet. I want to kind of like look down the hallway. Um, what do we have here? This is the feeder club's room. It's locked. I may be able to find some curtains in there. I wonder if any of the girls is a member of this club. We do have a dusty hairpin, so I think we can pick that lock. Um, that's gonna be assumingly for the negative route. That's probably gonna lead to its own kind of ending. Say, so are any of you members of the feeder club? Not really. Not really. Not me. Who wants to know? Well, there's a talent agent waiting outside. He's only interested in teenage girls with a passion for role-playing, though. That... that... yeah. What is that you want? I just need to borrow something from your club room. You have the key with you, don't you? Hmm. Fine, you can have it. If you can do me a favor first. I'll do you a favor. I'll conveniently forget to tell the principal that you free broke in the school at night. Deal. Aren't you trespassing too? So, what's the favor you need? Get my notebook. It's in classroom 3C under my desk. Should I get the notebook for? Yeah, sure, why not? You will? Then when you find it, please don't look through it. Sure, sure. Sort the desks. Might as well do it. Let's do it. There we go. Phew! Man, you really need to sort your desk a little better. Damn! One desk, one desk. Nothing. There's a red notebook here. Okay. I feel like we're not supposed to read it. Which we won't this route. I'll definitely steal one of these. They weren't so darn heavy. 
close them. Some books and shock. Take it? Yes. Excuse just podium. A geography book and globe on top of it. Nice. Here, your book. Is this your notebook? Yeah, that's it. I hope you didn't look through it. Nope, your secrets are safe. How would you know I have secrets? Alright. Here's the key. Bring it back when you're done with it. I bet you actually can bring it back when you're done with it. Thanks! Okay. Computer club key. How oh, neatly floated drapes. Take them? Yes. This could be useful. In currents. Soft red current. Draw current? Yes. A chalkboard. There's some stars drawn on it. Table of blank sheets of poster paper and some colored pencils. Really no incentive to check out the contents of the trash can. Record various hearts and scarves. Cardboard boxes. Cardboard boxes. Some have made costumes. Pfft. <laughs> and poor tasting clothes. Some cardboard boxes full of new and costumes. Paint. Makeup. We're done here. Oh yeah, we have a light. Oops. Yeah. We have electricity here. I forgot about that. Can we like lock it? <laughs> That's kind of curious. Here. Are you done with it? Yeah, thanks. I'm surprised you even give it back. Maybe I misjudged you. Still really counts fix your ribbon. Will you at least tell us more about your game. I'll let you know how it went on Monday. If it's anything like the rest I tried, it won't really do anything. It's a little chit chat. Are we suddenly friends or something? She's alright, I guess. But she ruined our night. Sorry about that. Oh, alright, fine. Baka. She means apology accepted. Nice to meet you then. I'm Kat. We know. I'm Julie. This is Saki and this is Kaya. Nice to meet you. Good luck with your game. You know, you're quite the celebrity among third year students. For all the wrong reasons. You should have a free see sometime. It's good to finally make some new friends. Do you, um, need help with that right Oh, uh, no. I'm, I'm just fidgeting. Got it. Did the chair sit down? Yes. What are you doing? I thought you were busy. I'm just taking a break. Is that so? Are you scared? You're scared, aren't you? Did you come to us for comfort? The only scary thing here is that attitude of yours. She's still upset at you messing up her night, as you can see. It's okay to be scared. Oh, I know. Why don't you show us your ritual as an apology? I'm kind of interested, too. Well, the rules say... Oh, come on. You don't actually think it's gonna work, do you? It's just a game, as you said. The rules don't actually matter. I think they probably do. I suppose not. Then it's decided. We'll tag along with you. You're tasked with entertaining us now. Well, I suppose you can't be helped. Let's go then. Okay, that's completely new. I don't think you can make a party with them before. Oh wait, we can do this now with the song. Synchronized dancing. Sweet. To the save point! Is this stuff crow just so cool? Ah, 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 ah. Oh no. So you're that type, huh? It was an accident! What is that supposed to mean anyways? This isn't good. It's okay, you can just apologize next week. Yeah, it's okay. It was probably the only valuable thing in this room anyways. Ah. Wait, we can't save anymore? Crow, are you dead? It's messed up now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I suppose we get some of our hair. We only need a tough of hair for the ritual. I guess. 
<sighs> Here I go, I suppose. See my hair. I never want to do that again. You're so brave, cat. Thanks. Now let me think. Ritual. Okay. This should do the trick. Perfect. Totally. Nobody will even notice. That's one objective down. What was the other one? We have 12 candles. Three rooms. Lighter. Draw fall lights and draw the curtains in each classroom. Draw a path going through the three rooms with chalk. Hmm. Well, my lines aren't perfect, but I should do the job. I can do this in all three rooms. I'm wondering if you have to like, specifically do it a certain way, like... Chalk, chalk, chalk. Then... Who knows the classroom? I saw something there, but it's okay. We're fine. Two down, one to go. Alright, let's see. There's a ton of useless objects in the boxes and a letter. Read it, yes. Roses are red, violets are probably violet. I love for you sparkles like the glow of a diamond. I watch you every day, I watch you every night. I watch you. I watch you, I watch you, I watch you, I watch you. Oh god. The other side of the paper is filled with black scribbles. Is everyone in your club okay? Right now, I'm not sure. Chuck. Okay. Now we just need to set candles in each room. In the middle room. No. The window's cracked. That spooked me. This isn't good for my heart. You guys can come to the other world with me? Because, you know, we're all going to end up in some kind of corpse party situation, right? We're perfect for it. You probably should, I sh you all probably should have, like, gone home. I'm just saying, this, this is pretty bad. Candles. Lighter. Nice. Very atmospheric. Kind of romantic. Nice. Now what? Now we just wait five minutes. Doing nothing. Peace and quiet, not as bad as you imagine. After that, I'll burn the hair and you hope you blow out the candles one by one. Burn hair smells bad. It does. What's the last step? Might as well do it right. What happens then? No idea. Really? We probably just clean up and go home. These rituals are a scam, you know? So you're just making us make a mess so that we can help you clean it up. E. <laughs> What's the matter? Are you not entertained? <sighs> I think it's time. Finally! Now I just burn this. Quickly put out the candles now. You were a little slow on that last one. I'm a little worried. Now shut your eyes and be quiet while I count to 100, okay? Got it. 1, 50. Alright, then I'll start. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight. Shh. Thirty-nine, eighty, eighty-one. 
Uh-oh. What? 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 Huh? What the hell was that? 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Huh! 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 What? What the? Are those? I've made a terrible mistake of bringing you along with me. Julie's dismembered body. What? This can't be. Kaya's lifeless body. Oh my god. She didn't deserve this. Saki's headless body. No way. This can't be real. Well, I should probably head on out of here. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say everyone's dead. Me like me on stone. You know, despite the rules, every so often some moron thinks they can bring in an entire group. Huh? Who's there? Where's this place? I would have at least made it interesting for you. But now, forget it. Wait, what, wait, wait! Dead NK5. Party wipe. Alright. You see all of us? We cannot be friends. Well, we can be friends. But I cannot, you guys cannot hang out with me. Okay? Don't hang out with me. Don't even, don't even follow me. Don't. It's probably gonna take us down the typical route, I'm assuming. Okay. Everything's ready. All stuff is to wait five minutes and then burn the hair. This is gonna be such a pain to clean up. Seriously? Stop messing with things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost, the devil, or some kind of anime demon boy, exhibiting your soul to interning the Neverworld? What if your soul's already damned? Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! It was a joke. You're not gonna find him this way, you know. Your anime demon boy. You'll just do whatever you want, no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. Secretly, Project Cat is just the story of the Labyrinth, David Bowie. It's this anime version. Well, they actually did make an anime version of the Labyrinth. Well, it was a manga. I prefer ambitious idiots. So, will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, Cat, you know that? Yet here we are. Fine, you win. It's in the Occult Club. There's a golden envelope in one of the drawers. But they won't let you step around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. Huh? Is there somebody at the door? Objectives updated. Hi there. And one left. Hey, Crow! There's a golden envelope in the drawer. These are the instructions for the ritual I'm doing. Thankfully, I showed them when I wrote my notes. Read the full ritual rules. You must play alone. <laughs> we learned that the hard way. Requirements. Three dark adjacent rooms, 12 candles, a lighter of matches. A ruin, a tuft of human hair, white chalk or white paint. Preparations. Start after the sun has set. All three rooms must be pitch black, turn off all lights, draw the curtains, and close the doors. Using the chalk or paint, draw a path going through the three rooms as path will serve to connect your current location to your destination. In the middle room, place six candles on each side of the drawn path parallel to it. Instructions. Let each of the candles let them burn for at least five minutes. From this point, you can no longer abort the ritual. After the five minutes have passed, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Proceed to blow out all the candles one by one. When the last candle is put out, quickly close your eyes and count to a hundred. Open your eyes. To remember, you must always close the door behind you. Leave it open may attract unwanted attention. Do not let the ruin out of your possession. It is your only protection. 
Do not bring any weapons with you. If you arm yourself, so will they. Should anything be heard or felt while you count to hundred, it must be ignored. Do not open your eyes. Do not turn on the lights. Do not move. It is normal to feel like you're not alone. You won't be. Isn't the scissors kind of a weapon? Let me look at this. Hmm. Oops. I technically we like left the room because of the knock, right? Isn't that technically like breaking the rules? Oops. Let's do this. All right, now it's just to blow up. Huh? The kettles? Did they just? I guess I should count to a hundred. One, two, three, four, five. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Why am I doing this? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. Fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight. I wonder if Mom is worried about me. She will be after you go to the demon realm. Huh? What was that? Don't open your eyes. Seventy-nine, eighty, eighty-one. What's all that noise? Is anyone there? 97, 98, 99. 100. So I open my eyes? It worked. It worked. It worked! I can't believe it! This is incredible. But where am I? It's a hallway. It definitely is in the school. This is unbelievable. How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting! I can't believe it worked till we die. If I wake up from this and it turns out to be a dream, well... That would be disappointing, to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. Do you wish to save your progress? Yes. Nice. A black substance dripped down from above. Whatever it is, it looks disgusting. Where's this stuff coming from? A fairly normal looking door. It's locked. Can I, like, run now? The way these mirrors are in the walls is almost comforting. But staring into mirrors in a place like this, it's almost like I'm asking to be jump scared. The door of a glossy finish. You can see yourself in it. It's locked. Nonsensical pipes run all over the place. They're warm to the touch. It's just some sort of heating. A large amount of black substance that's accumulated under the stairs. This stuff makes me uneasy. What if it comes alive or something? A door with an odd pattern. It's locked. A door with an odd pattern. It's locked. A door with an odd pattern. It's very locked. A large amount of black substance. A small door with an odd pattern. It's locked. That's strange. Have I already passed through here? Yes. I have. Hmm. There must be something I missed. Yep. I think we're making progress. Just keep going. Eventually it'll change. Uh, am I lost? I don't remember this hallway being so long before. It's a key hanging from a hook. Take the key. A fairly normal looking key. Door has no keyhole. Door also has no keyhole. this one. Fairly normal looking key for a fairly normal looking door. 
Yes. Huh, what's this? I'm back at the school already. No running in the hallways, no screaming to Reese's, no escaping ever. I'm gonna run in the hallways now. Wait, no, I shouldn't. 4A. 56W. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while, and in return you get... Nothing. Huh? Who's talking? Anime demon boys. It's too early to see anything on the other side. I mean, actually, we don't know who they are, but still. Hey! Rude! Damn it! Man, it must be nice being like a other dimensional, like, anime demon boy. Just mess with people. Like, you just end up in your dimension, like, I'm just gonna shove you over. Nothing you can do about it's my anime demon boy dimension. What you gonna do about it? Oh, 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 look at this. I'm gonna shove you over again. Oh. Oh, what's this? Can't do anything. I'm gonna play basketball. And that's just all I'm gonna do. Because it's my demon boy dimension. I can play basketball here. That's right. Do anything. Do you even know where you are? You chose a one-way trip to hell, kid. Where are you? Well, if you're not gonna help, then be quiet. I'll leave once I find what I came for. Hey, letters. Unsealed golden letters scattered across the floor. They seem to be rituals of various titles. The mirror ritual. The ritual of the well. The bus ritual. The free room ritual. This is the one I did. These all come in golden letters. Do they all work? I should look into this when I get home. You think you can leave? Now that you can prove that these rituals work. You have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. That's... That's a lie, right? You're just trying to scare me. Nope, it's real. Trust me, I'm an anime demon boy, I think. I don't know. Are you lost? Yes. You should give up. You will never leave this place. Frankly, I'm half expecting Cat to never leave this place. As in, like, in the full game. So you all like to watch. It's like reality TV for you all. Your mother will be devastated to learn that she's now completely alone. No husband. No daughter. Everybody left her. How pitiful. How dare you say something like that? You know nothing about me. This is no could be like, yeah, I know everything about you. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then. And now you won't tell your mother goodbye either. Oh, so this is why she wants to do the ritual. She wants to talk to her dad. I don't remember if that was in the original prologue or not. This seems kind of like... It's been a while. Whoever told you that someone you know is in here with you? Would that make you hopeful? Really? Yes, I double-checked. He's like, yeah, this was in the original. I know you're thinking you can escape with them. But these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. Could be also the other character. Uh, I think... The actual main character of this game is not Cat, or at least has a secondary character anyway, kind of Nero to uh, Dante. After all, why would you give your prey an escape? Cut it out. Those windows are expensive. Cat, I know more about you than you think. Let me show you something. This, I don't remember. Yes, this is completely new. Huh? This is... 
a painting of a vague memory. Trash can full of blank pieces of paper. Science pages being... What's that? Some books on physiological changes in humans in specific environments. There's also a notebook filled with rough scribbles and notes. Val of souls from Alvo below the Ot follow instructions envelope. It's too hasty to read. It's a book and photo of someone. Books and autobiographical experiences. A pile of books. The top one's called Depictions of Physiological Trauma, Research Patients. Whoa. -oh. Just what is this place? What do you think you are? So, what do you think? I can see everything that's in your head. You really should make an effort to be more lively. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you. You know. And then... Snap. Just gonna calmly walk on out of here. Just avoid the Slender Man. I think I'm gonna start sprinting on out of here. Music's kind of stopping. Uh oh. How would you like to stay trapped in here until you die? I'm just gonna sit here calmly. Maybe now you will reflect on the stupidity of your actions. Nope, I'm not. I'm just gonna sit here calmly. Not much you can do to me. In the meantime, I'll just watch you run away. Shut up! That's enough! Whoever you are, get out of my head! My life. It's my business. My decisions are mine alone. Let me out of this place. I don't know there's a way out. There has to be. Please. I want to go home. That's more like it. Hey, I can go home. I'm back in this hallway. I don't like this. I need to get out of here. Notice how the door they came out of is one with reflection. Symbolic, see? Rhymes like poetry. This isn't fun anymore. I need to find a way back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe you should file out before doing this. This door is open. Wasn't it boarded up? Everything else is locked. I have nowhere to us but to go in. Blood. Blood. Saki's beheaded corpse lies here. This can't be. How's this possible? I just saw her a while ago. I, I don't understand. Kaya's bloody corpse. Oh no, 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 no. Oh my god. This can't be real. It's not real. Right? Julie's bloody corpse. Her lower half is missing. I... This is my fault. A welcoming door. It's locked. I... I have to... Get out. Vulture's door has no keyhole. Oh, we tried it. That's not gonna help. Oh, I opened. The door? I can leave? I can go home.
I don't want to die. Why not? Everybody should try it at least once. The end. So we do have quite a few more endings to find. We gotta go back and uh, dig them up. So I'm not really sure, like, is Cat gonna survive? Like, is Project Cat, is that just the title of, like, the prologue? Because I think the full game is called Paper Lily, or, like, it's... True Entry K1, Curiosity Killed the Cat. Because that ending kind of implies that she got killed. And I see there's, like, a, a blonde-haired girl who might be the actual protag. No, from the devs. Really appreciate you taking time to play our little game. It means the world to us. You have played as a prologue of Paper Lily, a larger project we're currently working on. That means the feedback for Project Cat so far, and we hope you look forward to Chapter 1 coming soon. If you like what you played, it would help us a lot if you could leave a review. Thank you so much. Alright, so... Let's start trying to get our endings. The first thing I'm gonna think of is let's try leaving the school with you all. Because if we take you to the other world, you all die. What are you doing? Are we done already? Yeah, let's go. Really? I guess I'll get my stuff. Is this a viable ending? Yeah! And so we went home without completing the ritual. And for some reason, I lost interest after that. In exchange, I gained some new people to talk to. Well, I suppose the ritual couldn't have been that important anyways. Dead end K4. Never mind forever. Hmm. Safe file looks a little interesting. Can't load it, though. Ah, see? That's gonna be... See, it doesn't say prologue. Paper Lily Chapter 1. It's like a little Easter egg. It's locked. This room is... What is this room, anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. Me neither. So why don't we check it out? You want to bring in this room? Why not? Can't be worse than trying a silly ritual. I hope it's safe. We would need a way to open it, though. We're counting on you. You can do it, Cat. I never said... She's fine. Doing crimes. It's so dark. Let's see what's behind this door. Maybe we'll find exam answers. Or dead bodies. Or maybe it's just a supply closet. Heh. <laughs> Got it. Door unlocked. It's so dark. Come on, Ponytail, don't chicken on me now. Don't call me that. You have a Ponytail, don't you? I have a name too. What we got here? Some used brooms. Large locker, pocket for the person, it's locked. Hmm, okay. A calendar information sheet for cleaning the staff. Trash can. Why won't there be a trash can in a supply closet? Why wouldn't there be? Maybe it's a spare? Boxes filled with rags, never cleaning supplies. A cleaning cart. It could use some cleaning. Lots of cleaning supplies, it smells weird. A dusty lamp, the light bulb is missing. A lot of school supplies. Some boxes filled with random objects. No, this is the lost and the found box. Really? Look, I found my old shoe. A shoe? I lost it years ago. How do you lose one shoe? It just disappeared. Oh, my lighter! Don't you already have a lighter? This is my old one. You lost a lighter in the school? No, they confiscated it. Figures, lighters can be dangerous. Only in the wrong hands. And yours aren't. You shouldn't bring lighters to school. School supplies. Books and paints line the shelves. Small key in one of the shelves. Probably for that locker. Hmm. The key fits. There's some dusty documents that catch your eye. Read them, yes. It's, uh... Lawsuit. What's that doing in a place like this? I heard about that from my dad. Supposedly someone sued the school because of their daughter's disappearance. Ooh. 
Oh, a second year girl. I heard something happen, but I didn't know the school was involved. I don't know either. But she was last seen at school, so her family was convinced that something happened here and was covered up. Poor demon boys. Eating good. There's definitely an odd history of disappearances in this town. When I graduate, I'm out of here. No, you're gonna be dead. Unless we get a good ending. Well, bad ending, technically. Oh yeah, there's a light. Well, that's ominous. The darkness won't hurt anybody. Probably. We need to hear for the ritual. No. We need just a bit of hair. Why don't you get your own? Why don't you girls want to participate? I don't mind helping. No, Kaya, you don't have to do that. That's alright, I'll give you mine. There's no need for that, I'll just cut some of mine. Are you sure? Yeah, it'd be a waste to use yours. Alright. Thanks. Ugh. It's done. Self-portrait. It's the most portly thing you've done today. Is that supposed to be you? Please never draw a portrait of me. I was applying to. My fabulous masterpiece is displayed here. Are you leaving this here? Why not? I'll pick it up before going home. May I look through it? No. Okay, let's see. Lettuce. Um, why is there lettuce in your bag? What, what, what did I just say? So, why is there lettuce in your bag? My mom has to pick it up on the way home, okay? God. Fine, fine. Put the lettuce back. There's a gold envelope in the drawer. These are the instructions for the ritual I'm doing. Thankfully, I showed them when I wrote my notes. Let's play alone, requirements. Let's see how the girls comment on this, because they all died. Uh, the ever ending. Is that the ritual we're doing right now? Yeah. I wonder if anyone else has tried it. Probably not. It was sealed when I got it. That's weird. Did they think it was cursed? Maybe. I should probably glue it back later. What the hell? Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? Maybe it's a sign. Hmm? I've been in this area before. Wait a moment. This doesn't look right. We should have come across the stairs a while back. That's true. Maybe we took a wrong turn somewhere. Let's just keep going. We're... Back here? Maybe this is the school's way of saying you can't leave now. How can you just say something like that? Are we going to home soon? Alright, I've reloaded, because we were basically heading towards a dead end route. Let's try going in here, um... When the, the school's already, like, gone evil. It's so dark. Let's see what's beyond this door. Maybe we'll find exam answers. Or dead bodies. Maybe it's just a supply closet. Okay, we're in. It's so dark. Come on, Point Tail, don't you got me now. Same dialogue. That's new. That's weird. What is? The existence of this room makes no sense. What do you mean? Based on the shape of the school, there can't be a room here. It'd be floating in the air when seen from the outside. Interesting. But we didn't even finish the ritual! What's happening? I don't know. Isn't it exciting? Let's keep going. Large well, locker sealed shut. Cleaning products. That all seems normal. There's no dates or months and names on it. Deja vu. So, maybe the ritual worked? But the ritual wasn't finished. Which means either the school is a bunch of cursed looking rooms and a dark secret, or this isn't the school anymore. If it's not the school, then what is it? No idea. In any case, it doesn't feel too dangerous, so let's continue. Oh yeah, we didn't get the key. Well, they're all locked anyways. 
long hallway. This room feels different. Is it safe? Ah, there you are. Who are you? What is this place? Straight to the point, I see. Well, this isn't quite your world. What? Let's not get into it. You're doing a ritual, correct? Stop and go home. All of you. I mean it. Excuse me? Cat, if you keep doing what you're doing, things won't end well. Do you know this person, Cat? Not at all. They seem to know you, though. What is it with everyone warning me lately? I need some answers. You're gonna die. So far you have- Stop. Don't cross that line. <sighs> if you haven't realized by now, the ritual works. It will take you somewhere you'll never return from. If it works, then... I should definitely finish it. Cat, what are you saying? Sorry, but I can't listen to this person. I have my reasons for doing this. I don't know how much you value what you have right now, but... If you continue down this path, you will lose everything. Everything you hold dear and everything you don't. Your questions will not receive any satisfying answers. And everything you know about the world will turn meaningless. Those free. Are you willing to sacrifice our lives for your so-called reasons? Lives? Furthermore, your own life. Are you willing to die for the answers you're seeking? Let's go back, Cat. I want to leave. I don't believe you. Why don't you just give me my answers yourself, then? Spare me the trip. I thought so. I've said what I needed to. Why? Who are you? Just someone who has seen too many humans die. It would send me to add you four to the pile. Go home, Cat. Can't you feel it in the air here? You're all in danger. Cat, please, this feels too dangerous. Cat, let's just go. Yeah, let's get out of here. I didn't sign up for this. You technically did. Cat, we don't want something bad to happen to you. Fine, let's go. Are you by any chance the same person from my dream earlier today? A dream? It must have been your subconscious warning you as well. I see. I'll pass on the ritual. For tonight. That's good enough. And so we left the school and walked home. No one said anything for a while. I think Kat is feeling down. Yeah. Should we do something? What's in your mind? I don't know. Do you think Cat likes to sing? Hmm. Kotiyasaki. Have you seen this excited about karaoke before, Kaya? That's a yes, then? Alright. So... We were thinking of going to this place. I can't do this, she's ignoring me. Cat. Hmm? Come with us. Huh? Just come. Sure, whatever. You're so good. Are they trying to cheer me up? Good ending, technically. Maybe things are better this way. I need to believe that much, at least. Dead end K7. Girls night out. I like how all the good ends are dead ends. It's like, well, no one got slaughtered, so nothing interesting happened. Dead end. Oh no! What are you doing? Is this part of the ritual? Yeah. This plant is no longer happy. Um, what's wrong with you? If this ritual involves the mass genocide of harmless plants, then I want nothing to do with it. Agreed. The plant is also no longer happy. Are you seriously going around killing all the plants? I knew you were a psychopath. Sorry, Cap, but we didn't sign up for this. I don't like this ritual anymore. You wouldn't like the alternate version. Don't worry, Kai, we're going home now. Don't talk to us again. Once they were gone, I felt a bit guilty, so I went home as well. Maybe I'll try the ritual again some other time. Next time, I hope not to run into anyone. Dead NK6. Snip, snip. Alright, let's try leaving during the ritual. Like once we've already been transported to the other world. Let's go home.
Here we go. So when we were with the group of girls, we went down an endless hallway, and essentially we were locked into the one bad end where everyone was going to die together. Now we have an endless stairs. This really is like Corpse Party. What's going on? These stairs are making no sense right now. This building has only three floors. I've taken these stairs every day. I must be really tired. I'll just go down without thinking. I can't get anywhere. Am I dreaming right now? I think I'll just rest here. Good morning. Someone will wake me up. Hopefully at home in my own bed. Next time I woke up, I was still in the same place. I tried again going up, going down, it made no difference. I decided to make an experiment with chalk. Logic would dictate that this X isn't here if I go up or down a floor. Objectives update, and it's gonna be like, objective die. If I'm really trapped in a loop, then X will still be here when I go up. Test your theory. I'm... trapped. I don't think I'm gonna make it home tonight either. Sorry, Mom. Dead in K3. Academic Spiral. So here's what happens if you cut some hair. <laughs> Ten girl's hair. Did you just... Oh my god. What have you done? Get the hell out. At least I got what I needed. Get on my face. Don't talk to me anymore. I won't forget this. Sangly fit you with a ribbon. Hmm. Not working. This is more evil looking when I like lock picked in here. The chalkboard is something drawn on it. Where did they find red chalk? Yeah. There's a red notebook here. Looks like a private journal. Look through it? Yes. Let's see. It's just math problems and girly doodles all over. This isn't worth my time. Huh? This is... Forget you. Not history, uh. You really should make an effort to be more lively. The only time I'm done playing around with you, you know. And then, snap. My life is my business. My decisions are mine alone. Be strong. I I'm not gonna give you the reaction you want. I'm better than that. You think you can come here and torture me? Yeah. If entertainment is what you want, then I'll just bore you to death. I hope you have a good book nearby. I, in fact, do. I have all the books in the world. Have it your way. I didn't hear from the voice again. But no matter how much I want to, I didn't scream for help. Someone will come for me. Eventually. I just know it. Maybe someone will? Who knows? Dead NK8. My way. So that's it for Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue, aka the Project Cat uh, demo remake. So the full game is going to be called Paper Lily. I don't think Project Cat's going to be in the name uh, whatsoever, possibly. Because I legitimately think Cat just may be dead. I, I, don't, I think it's a... Uh, it's kind of a, a false protag situation. I, I could be wrong. Maybe you'll come across Cat in the other world. Maybe she's still alive somehow. Because we never did see a confirmation she died, died. We just see, you know, Curiosity killed the cat. And then we heard, like, a, a noise. As far as I can tell from the screenshots of the, the full game, the, the blonde-haired girl, like you see in the save file, is the 
playable character, or at least the primary one. Cat character-wise, with the remake of the demo, we kind of get a fleshing out of what their motivations are. Um, we find out that the dad was looking into astral projection and other worlds and everything. And most likely, they also did a ritual. They went to the other world. Probably got killed by the demons or something. Cat wanted to do the same thing, wanted to find her dad, and then, well, she, she shouldn't have done that. It was a one-way trip. And in the canon ending, she also assumingly gets the other girls killed, because they're in the school when she does the ritual. And as we know what happens when that happens, uh, everyone else dies. On the spot, Cat gets picked off later. So, like most horror RPG Maker games, going all the way back to Corpse Party and them, <laughs> pretty much it's, don't do weird rituals in school, don't do them at home, because at some point you're going to be transported to an anime demon boy dimension and things are just going to go terrible. But yep, the, it's still as promising as ever. The upgrades to the, the demo are pretty much a straight upgrade. The other characters got a little bit more fleshed out, and it just kind of leaves us wanting more. So, till the full game releases. Anyway, thank you all for watching me play Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.